In this video, I'm going to take this board. It's a piece of 3 8 three eighth inch poplar. I'm going to take that board. I'm going to cut off. It's four inches wide. I'm going to cut off a little more than four inches on the end, and I'm going to make a bowl out of it. Just that little piece of wood. So stay tuned, and you'll see what it looks like. So there is the bowl that I made from that piece of wood. Cut a piece of this wood four inches wide long. And that's a four inch wide board and I made that bowl out of it. Now you want to see how that's done and learn how the pattern works for various bowls. Well stay tuned and I'll show that to you. So here's that piece I cut off of that piece of poplar. It is the three eighths. That's the pattern. I created that. I'll give a link to the website where I, you can draw those patterns. I figured the angle and that that's going to be a quarter inch wide ring. Each ring is going to be a quarter inch wide. You got a piece of 3 eighths inch thickness. So that's the angle. I've got it written on there. It's 33.3 degrees to get that the proper width of each uh, layer, each ring, and have a match up to make a bowl. So let me take that over and cut it and we'll put it together and show how it's built up. So here we are, we're back to this finished bowl. That's a half inch, made out of half inch poplar. And what I have here is four bowls. All four of those bowls were made from the same pattern. That's a four inch pattern, quarter inch walls. And you create those patterns at scrollmania.com. That's a very simple, basic way of doing one. You can get more complex. But I wanted to show uh, that this each one of these bowls was made out of the same pattern. They're all the four inch bowls, but you could change the angle depending on the width of the material. This is three quarter inch, that's half inch, that's three eighths, and that's one quarter. So in order to get the bottom of the top ring to match up with the bottom of the, the top of the second ring, you have to cut the proper angle. And that, there's a calculator there to tell you that. It's a pretty neat website. Uh, he designed the Wonder Bowl that I, I created in a video or two back. And I'm learning how to make these bowls through his website where he has these calculators and he has a program that draws these patterns for you. Uh, he has some tutorials showing you how to use it. 
So it's kind of opened up a little new avenue for me, and I'm going to experiment with the different materials and mixing colors and, and changing some shapes, getting some ovals and various other things. So anyway, that's, like I say, though, that's the difference in the thickness of the wood. You can see the difference in the, in the bowl. That's almost like a cup. But anyway, it looks kind of like, it looks like a flower pot, I think. But anyway, that's uh, what the gist of this video is about. It kind of covers how you can make a bowl out of a piece of wood, just a flat piece of wood, and make a bowl. So if you like that, hit the like button and subscribe if you're not subscribed. And uh, you'll see some different uses of this this website and some future videos with some different bowls and, and mixing and matching of, uh, of materials to make some different looking things. I'm also learning better how to sand them and make them look good. Uh, I don't have some real good sanding equipment that works on this, but I'm beginning to adapt to some other things. So thanks for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.